Hey guys, Italy Horse 45 here, and today I'm going to be making you a video about my updated version of my C++ database program. Now, sorry I haven't made a video in a while, but uh, I'm kind of busy with sports and stuff, but, uh, well, here I am. I'll go ahead and run the program for you. Now, you might notice this clear log function. Now, what happens is if I input a name and put in all the information and stuff, and if I go search the database for it and go to display all, you'll see that there's a employee in there. Now, if you go to clear log, put yes, and then go back and search search it, uh, it's been cleared out. Now, what this does is, I'll show you right here. Um, down here, there's the delete file function, and here you declare a string, display the information, uh, that you want them to input and ask for the input right here with the sin, sin function. Um, then create an if statement, and in here you want to if the inputted variable is equal to y, um, open a file. And this yet this file right here, this information has to be the same as the one you declared up above. Now what this does is, whenever you open a file in the same directory as as the uh, with the same name as one prior. It'll just it'll just clear it. It'll just create a whole new file, and uh, after that, just clear the screen, display. Uh, it's been completed and stuff. Just, make, just let them know it's been done correctly, and uh, close the file. Make sure if you don't do that, if you don't, it won't do anything. It won't change anything, and go back to the main function and create an else just to handle in case they don't put in Y. If they put in N, it'll just take them back to the main menu, or if they put in any other sequence of uh, strings or variables, it will take them back to the main menu. And, well, that's about it. Thanks for viewing. Make sure you subscribe, like. See you in the next video.